patriotic alliance. They want ETA out of the government of national confusion. Uh, well, national uh, unity, so they say. But, well, I don't know if it's really a government of national unity, right? Nothing is as confusing as that government, yeah? Come to think of it, guys, nothing is as confusing as that government. But, 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 in this YouTube channel, we've got something that is unconfusing. Well, Nomvula Makonyan, who was asked to go to are you guys trapped in this thing? No, we are not trapped. That's what she said. Utika, we are not trapped by the, the, the partnership we are having. She said in an article released by Uma Madiehi Ma Shamaite, Uti, Uti, ANC First Deputy Secretary General Nomvula Makonyane is adamant that ANC can form a government of national unity without the DA after the two parties clashed over cabinet position. You were not supposed to even think of it, DA, but you did it. Now today you are you find yourself in a situation like this. Benyap. Benyap said. Benyap. Ngang child benyap. Megabang child. Tiko. Hey. Hey. Maybe I have the learning child guys. Begi wab. But mean I know where we are going. You know what I'm saying? This is where we're going. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people, because to subscribe it is free, to like the video it is free, to comment in the comment section below it is free of charge, to click the notification bell it is free of charge, to share this video it is free of charge, to watch this video until the end it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean come on, to watch the ads it's free of charge and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financially contributing to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed all right all right so where do we start let's start with the article um, yeah, there is no government of, of national unity <laughs> there is no government of national unity between the anc and the da we called all political parties. The DA allegedly leaked their proposal to the media when there was a process of negotiations and that have been taking place. As we all consultation between the leaders of political parties said, right? So in other words, the ANC, they are blaming EDA saying, Nina, you are busy leaking the letters to the media. You are the ones who are busy leaking letters, right? Um, she did not take kindly to the DA's demands to have the representation in all cabinet clusters uh, wanting 12 posts, right? She says, no self-respecting no, no self organization can settle on what they are putting on the table. Because it is like they are imposing what they believe is good for them. We can still form a government of national unity with or without ETA. My question is right there. Bamba Manangelapo or Mana Manamana. Do you think that your father, your brother, whatever you call him, 
your president, the one that you must be protected. Do you think he will agree to that sentiment that, oh, it doesn't matter, uh, uh, this, it doesn't matter, that uh, we can form a coalition without the DA? I don't think so. I think it's a sentiment from other ANC people who think that. But the Ramaphosa regime, oh, they want the DA by fire, by force. I'm telling you, they wanted DA by fire, by force. They wouldn't function except there's DA involved. So it is what they want, but it's not necessarily what um, it's not necessarily what Rama 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 Ramdola Ramaphoria will want, right? It's not what they want. He continues to say, nobody can give us an alternative uh, because it is not about any individual party. It is about the future of this country and the respect of everybody who is represented in parliament through all other political parties. Represented there. Right? Regarding the negotiations, Mokonyana says there was ongoing discussions on multiple parties. Now, she says... There has been a back, back and forth with many parties, including those that are as yet to make a public announcement as to whether they are in or not. Mina, I hear Unamvula Makonyan that she believes a government of national um, a government of national confusion can be formed without uh, without without ETA which I think it will be a government of national unit when the DA is out. I, I still think that it's his, um, it, is her, it is her view and other members of the ANC, but it's not a view of Uram Dola, the one who put money under Madras. It's not his view, right? I don't think so. But yeah, she says, uh, okay, wait a minute. Oh. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I was checking something here. Uh, we need to do a video right now about something. There's something that I just saw. But yeah, uh, tell me what you guys think about this, right? Let's go to a Patriotic Alliance. The Patriotic Alliance PA wants the Democratic Alliance DA out of the government of national unity Describing the, 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 the organization as a political bully. This is after it emerged that negotiations are stalled due to what has been described as the DA unreasonable demands of 12 cabinet positions. Patriotic Alliance Deputy Leader Kenny Gunenes claims that DA previously threatened to ditch the government of national unity. The Patriotic Alliance and the DA are seemingly struggling to put their differences aside, despite having to share a bird in the government of national unity. The two organizations have previously expressed their discontent over working or working together, citing their local dispute of local at local level as well. Um I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm still worried about the statement that they can still form a government, a government without ETA. Who is she representing there? Because we all know that uh, Ramaphosa is very... Ramaphosa signs a deal with ETA. And so, for the fact that he has exposed himself and they came out vulnerable... You know you are vulnerable when you say to your enemy, don't do this because you're going to hurt me. You already show your enemies that, you know what, I fear this. So if the TA, for instance, were to get the opportunity, were to run out of, look, look, were to look, ditch this thing, and decide not to be part of the government of national unity, Ramaphosa right there and they will know that, okay, my future as the president has just ran out in my presence. So Ramaphosa will want the DA in by fire, by force. 